Hello everybody and welcome to another Big C TV unboxing. My name is Chris aka Big C. So, this fall there have been a whole bunch of big name game releases and I originally planned on doing a whole bunch of cool unboxings of the various limited editions. Most of the limited editions have been kind of lame. Most just include either a season pass or like some DLC and not that exciting. But I finally have one that is exciting and it's for a game that I've been waiting to play for 10 years and I'm sure you can guess what is coming next. I'm here to unbox the limited edition of Final Fantasy 15. This is the Xbox One version so let's unbox this puppy and see what comes in the limited edition. Okay, so here is the box. Apparently it includes, if you look at the back, the game and the Kingsglaive movie. So it includes a movie as well as the game and some DLC. So of course the first thing we're going to look at is the Steelbook case. I am a sucker for Steelbook cases. They just look so cool. They're unique. They have some really nice looking art on them. Um, and that's part of why I, I, I'm one of the few people I know who uh, still insists on getting physical games. Because I honestly just like, I like looking at a box on my shelf. I just think it looks nice. Alright, so this is the front of the Final Fantasy XV box. It's got like a dragon thing and... It looks really cool. It's kind of a hand-drawn, artistic look to it. Various monsters. There's like a woman being carried by something that looks like Spawn. Here's some cute like dragon things in there. There's a lot to decipher out of this case. Here's the back of it. There's like a castle and more monsters. Um, I mean, not at all what... <laughs> anything that I've seen from the game so far or based on the preview art and all that but hey very nice looking case now I'm gonna open it and see what's inside okay so we have first off is the DLC deluxe edition tech it includes a Masamune DLC weapon a car skin and a Royal Raiment DLC costume. And it gives a bunch of instructions on how to download them and a download code, which I will not show you because that is mine. Uh, it also includes the booklet for Final Fantasy XV, which doesn't tell you much. It's mostly just instructional stuff, so not really anything of use. Um, Oh, this is cool. I like this. Now, this nice little art. Um, when you open it up, it says, thank you from your support. And there are all the signatures from the development team who've worked on this game for the last 10 years. That's really cool. Um, so... That's a nice touch. I like that a lot. And then looking in the box, we have the Final Fantasy XV Blu-ray disc and the Kingsglaive Final Fantasy XV Blu-ray disc. So two Blu-rays. Um, I'm going to pull the discs out for a second so we can look at the underside of the steelbook case. So if you look, here's more art. The one on the left is for the game. The one on the right is for the movie. Um, so yeah. Pretty solid. Um, so the limited edition costs you about 90 bucks. So an extra 30 gets you the steelbook. The movie on Blu-ray, which is 20 bucks on its own, and then extra DLC. 
So that's about that's about right. I only paid 70 77 I think for it cuz I am awesome and get things from Amazon. Um But yeah, uh it looks pretty solid. Um I wish it would have included a few more things. Like, I think it would have been cool, especially... Yeah, you're getting the Blu-ray for the, the movie. I think a digital code would have been cool, too. Include the movie on Blu-ray, plus a digital copy. Um, I mean, only three add-ons. That's kind of lame. Um, but... I mean, hey, I don't know how many add-ons they're planning on adding for this game, so... Probably a lot. Um, the case is really cool. So, I would say in terms of limited editions, it's decent. I wouldn't say it's a must-buy. Um, I mean, if you're a big Final Fantasy fan and you've been waiting for this game, like I have, I'm sure you probably already have the limited edition, limited edition of this game. Um, but if you're on the fence and want to pick up Final Fantasy XV and are not sure which version to get... I mean, if you really want to see the movie and you really want the game, it's not a bad pickup, but um, I don't think it's necessary, really. So, not bad. Cool looking box, cool stuff in it, but not the greatest package, I guess, for a uh, special edition of a game. So, that is my unboxing and my thoughts on the deluxe edition of Final Fantasy XV. And that's going to do it for this episode of Unboxing. If you have enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that subscribe button on YouTube. Check us out on Twitch, both of which are slash BigCTV. If you want to follow us on social media, Twitter and Facebook, that is slash BigCTV Show. And if you want to help shape the future of BigCTV, and become a Patreon patron. The link is patreon.com slash bigctv. Or, if you look below, I have a link for you. So, you can just click it and help shape the future of Big CTV. And, of course, I greatly appreciate any and all support. Whether it's financially or just watching the videos. So, thank you very much for all of your assistance and all of your support for Big CTV. And that's going to do it. I'm Chris. See you next time on Big C TV Unboxing. Set your